realize if it's backwards, it's not going to matter at all. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. This might be the worst tutorial ever. Um, so we're going to do just a slow playthrough of Why Did You Promise to Marry uh, from the William Vickers manuscript from around 1777 or so. Uh, Northumberland Vickers was a fiddler and has just an awesome collection of tunes. Uh, this tune played on the podcast this week is also Billy O'Rourke from uh, Fitzmaurice's manuscript and also shows up as, uh, oh, what was it? It's another Northumbrian collection as well uh, from Bruce and Stoker as uh, Hey, Your Jockey in the Hayloft, I think is what it is. So a tune that gets, gets around uh, a fair amount and it's a pretty good one. I mean, maybe it doesn't get around too much. You know, Fitzmaurice is recording and living in Edinburgh when he makes this, so it's not a huge stretch to get from Edinburgh to northeastern England, but um, popular tune. Anyway, so here it is. It's 9-8. Uh, Vickers doesn't include any gracing uh, on this setting, so it's all just me deciding what to do, um, which is how I interpret tune, you know, these old tunes that don't have any embellishments listed. So, of course, like, playing a tune from Northumbria, a tune that is, you know, played on Northumberland pipes, there's almost certainly going to be people that would, you know, say don't do any gracing, because that's how that tradition works, is you don't grace, you just kind of do staccato notes. Um, but if you're playing on highland pipes, or, you know, cold wind pipes, or border pipes, or whatever, you can't really do that. Uh, you could plug up, you know, if you're playing on a... I don't know, my D small pipes work where I can plug the bottom and can play it kind of bubbly. Um, but there are many notes, you know, there's a, the whole tune begins with, you know, you got your leading note, and then there's a quarter note, and then two eighth notes that are both, they're, all three of those notes are Ds, so there needs to be something splitting them up, and, you know, so I just do, that's, that's how I do it, but, uh, yeah, I don't know, if you wanted to be true to, like, Northeast England style today, you should do minimal gracing, I suppose, but part of my argument here is that this tune shows up uh, in Edinburgh being attributed to an Irish piper uh, by Vickers, and then uh, about a hundred years later, and Bruce and Stoke under a different name, so you know, people played this tune uh, all sorts of ways. So anyway, let's do a uh, slow through the first part. <laughs> Second part. Oh, sorry. fair amount of bending in this but I guess I do a fair amount of bending in it sorry I'm just trying to figure out the lighting here um do a fair amount of bending on a lot of tunes but these ones without grace notes always feels entitled to so the cool thing about why did you promise to marry Mary as the third part uh is new it's not in Billy O'Rourke from Fitzmaurice 
and it's just kind of arpeggios. <laughs> Yeah, good tune. Good tune. Sorry for the chanter crapping out. I use kind of needed a new uh, practice chanter read not too long ago and ordered them from Amazon, which felt pretty stupid. Uh, but it's a Fraser Warnock, and it's just way too loud and too much work. I like playing practice chanter to be easy rather than a strain. <laughs> so I rubber banded up. <laughs> Actually, it's not too bad now. Uh, anyway, let's do it all the way through nice and slow again. Solo tune, Why Did You Promise to Marry, Jockey in the Hayloft, and Billy O'Rourke. So, definitely a tune that's got some legs. Cheers, everyone. Not sure if we'll have a tutorial next week. Uh, yeah, while I'm traveling, especially as we get to the audiobook uh, episodes, I might not really be a way to do a tutorial on an audiobook. So, anyway, cheers. Uh, as always, if there's a tune that I've played... Like, at this point, everybody that's on the Patreon list is as good or better a piper than I am, or quickly learning. Um, so, I, I, yeah. But anyway, if there's a tune that I play that I do do something different on, that you're, uh, different on that you're interested in, feel free to mention um, the Patreon account, and I'll do a tutorial on that one. Anyway, cheers, everyone. <laughs>